Hi, this is Mohamed Shakil here and I'm going to guide you through the assembly of uh, junction stop valve in Kiteri 5. So we are almost uh, 1 by 3 of our uh, assembly here and the next part that is to be inserted is the uh, pin right here and you're going to coincide that pin to this particular uh, part here click on OK and edit mode manipulate on the x-axis I'm going to make this so our body is being hidden over here and once you unhide the body you can see that uh, you know you won't be able to make out where the object is that is the reason the body is hidden while the assembly uh, assembly design is in progress So once you're done with this, you can hide the body and you can see what else you can insert on the top of this. So you have another uh, insertion of another part here, that is the cover. And the cover you're going to coincide to click on OK, edit mode, manipulate on the Z axis, we're going to move this cover and you're going to click on OK, insert coincidence, you're going to do a coincidence for this and uh, once you're done with that, you need to use the contact constraint for this. So uh, you have created the cover on top of it and the next work is going to be uh, insertion of your nut and the bolt on all these places so you're going to insert circular pattern uh, the reuse pattern of the circular pattern that was used for the creation of this cover so insert existing component with positioning and again what you're going to do is uh, you're going to insert uh, <coughs> external bolt so show any one of the uh, uh, okay once you're done with that edit no manipulate on the z-axis pull it down and uh, then what you're going to do is uh, insert contact constraint and uh, update this and uh, you're uh, half away of this and you need to insert two nuts on this one is the lock nut and one is the normal nut so you're going to insert existing component with positioning you have the washer first so the washer goes first and click on the washer the contact constraint and I'll do the update here the next one the next one is going to be the hexagonal nut and I'm going to do the contact constraint for this Date. and on that I'm going to insert the hexagonal lock nut and uh, again over here I'm going to do the contact 
constraint. We'll do the update. And as you can see, this particular part is being complete here. And now your next next task is uh, the insertion, and uh, you're going to use the reuse pattern. Take the bolt and uh, hover your mouse over here so that you can see which is the part where you need to find the circular pattern for. Select the circular pattern and just click on OK. And our uh, assembly is automatically done for all these parts. So again, select the next one, use pattern, and uh, select the circular pattern. Click on OK and select the next one, use pattern, select the uh, circular pattern, click on OK, and our, uh, this much of our half of our assembly is almost complete here. So keep watching to uh, complete the whole design of our uh, junction stop valve in Kitty OB5. So I hope you enjoyed my video. Any doubts, any clarifications you have, you, ha you can uh, directly mail me by uh, shaxkittyab5online at gmail.com or put me a mail on uh, uh, YouTube uh, so that I'll be re uh, returning, replying back to you. So thank you so much for watching.